Well, it's almost one o'clock in the afternoon, April 16th, 2016. I stopped taking my blood pressure medicine. I, I was having some really bad side effects. I was having a hard time getting up the stairs. And uh, all kinds of other stuff. I'm still having, still getting over some of them, but I feel better today, actually. Um, I should go this way because I'm gonna get the mail. Being sent on a bunch of errands again. I want to finish that trailer up. I want to leave for Virginia tomorrow. That's my plan, or maybe later tonight. I'll leave tonight, so I'll have uh, I'll be able to come back tomorrow with the truck. So if I can like rush it. then uh, that'll be good. Right now I gotta get my mom's blood pressure medicine up at the pharmacy. And uh, I'll get the mail and, I, and she needs me to go shopping. I need to get some water and uh, sugar and other junk. And a bunch of uh, garage sales today. Maybe I'll be able to find a bar stool this summer. I can. I need a stool for uh, my computer setup. It's too high up. I have to stand up all the time. Otherwise, I'll build one later on. I'll build like a mini lifeguard stand or something. I don't know what. Or I'll put a car seat on top. So, I don't know. Let's just put some boxes up or something. It's a beautiful day today, though. Well, no mail. Just, just a uh, pin code for. I don't know what. One of my my NBO card, which I don't. Maybe they're sending me a new card or something, I don't know. So, off to the, uh, hmm, I don't know what I'll do first. I guess I'll try to fix the trailer first. No. Wish I knew what that noise is. Something dragging on this truck somewhere. I guess I'll go get my mom's blood pressure medicine. She took some today, so she really doesn't need it till tomorrow morning. She really cuts it close, so all the time. There's really no excuse. There's only it's only cost four dollars. Um. Yeah, I guess I'll go get some water and some. Uh, medicine. Fill this truck up with gas, see what my mileage is. I have the, uh, the other mileage. Put on my clipboard. I start using a clipboard system I used to use years ago to organize. Everything just falling into chaos. First stop is gas station. I'm going to fill this thing up. I'm going to figure out my mileage. Oh, it's $34 for, I think, 13.168 gallons or something like that. I'm going to figure it out in the parking lot of the drugstore. Oh, well, this isn't real great. Getting 11.6 mpg, more or less. All right, CBS, here I come. Okay, um, my brother's up at the house, so I'm gonna shoot back there. I'll get the water later. I really have no place to put it in this van anyway. And I cut this whole trip short. I'll get a gallon of water at the uh, dollar store. I had to stand in a big line to get the I couldn't get spring water, I got to get a gallon of distilled water. 
going to go back out with her car, I guess, after this. Well, it's about five minutes after four, and I'm just now finally getting to the storage unit. So, Ray saved me a trip to, he dropped, he left us four cases of water, which he just happened to have in his truck, so that was cool. He's really good to my mom. Um, so anyway, I'm going to go see if I can get those lights working on that trailer, somehow. I really like to leave this weekend. Maybe I'll leave tomorrow. I'm gonna probably have to go during the day since I don't have a license plate laid on that stupid thing. So maybe I'll. There's about three hours of light left right now. Maybe I'll go to uh, bring the trailer over to Jersey and cap off these tires. Try to get the lights working right. All right, it's back to this. See, what do I gotta do? I'll just bolt this on. I got some sandpaper I brought. Clear it off for it so it gets better connection. Okay, running lights are on. Let's see what we got here. It's looking good. On this side. Huh, I'm not seeing plenty of lights on this side though. The hell? Lights going on and off? What the hell? Oh, Jesus. This has to be miswired or something. messed up. Something's really, really wrong here. I don't know why it would be working worse with the trailer on. I know there's not a short. Okay, I'm going to try it this way. The blinkers are working. <laughs> They're kind of lame. I don't know why. Maybe that ground is bad or something. Maybe I have a bad connection somehow. It's working great with the light off common light off on this side and try the left. Well that seems to be let's see. Oh. It's hard to see that one because seems okay. Seems to falter, you know. I'm gonna hook it up and see if there's a bad ground. Okay, the emergency flashers seem to work. Well, I think this is good enough to run it. <clears throat> I think I need a little more wire on the front. So I'm gonna have to. I don't have any tape here or anything. I'm gonna add a little more wire. Man. It's kind of tight for those right turns. And like. Maybe a foot or two feet. I guess I'll add two feet and just tie wrap them. Well, it's another trip to the dollar store. I got the, um, I didn't go back to do the tires on that. I'm going to have to leave like Monday. I don't have a license plate late, so I can only use that thing in a day, so I have to leave like early. 
so I can get stuff done. Uh, what are you gonna do, Mrs. Deer? <laughs> so anyway, we're almost out of sugar, so I'm gonna go down and get some. Why do they always have a pile of cars in this lot? All right, one bag of sugar. Oh man, I can't wait to start getting some of this stuff together that's in the storage units. I should put a motorcycle together too, geez. Be a lot cheaper on gas. 11.6 miles a gallon in that van isn't gonna be cheap to be doing all these long runs. To get a vehicle running down in Virginia and just leave it there and then just take the motorcycle back and forth and then uh, use it to fix the house up and whatnot down in Virginia. Hoping to be moving to Texas eventually. I wanted to move to Florida but it's not really looking viable anymore. So I'm going to try out Texas again. This will be my third time going to Texas. I lived in the Dallas area in a place called Louisville. And I lived in the uh, uh, Houston area for a couple months. And this would be the San Antonio area. I don't know, I visited San Antonio and I didn't really like it, but maybe it grows on you.